हेलो एवरीवन इन दिस वीडियो विल डिस्कस अबाउट द कंसेप्ट ऑफ स्ट्रक्चर विद फंक्शंस एंड स्ट्रक्चर विद पॉइंटर्स स्ट्रक्चर्स कैन बी पास्ड एज अ फंक्शन आर्गुमेंट्स लाइक अदर डेटा टाइप्स वी कैन पास इंडिविजुअल मेंबर्स ऑफ अ स्ट्रक्चर एंड एंटायर स्ट्रक्चर और अ पॉइंटर टू अ स्ट्रक्चर टू अ फंक्शन लाइक ऑल अदर डेटा टाइप्स अ स्ट्रक्चर और अ स्ट्रक्चर मेंबर or a pointer to a structure can be returned by the function a structure can be passed to any function from the main function or from any sub function structure definition will be available within the function only there are three ways to passing entire structure to a function in c passing structure to a function by value passing structure to a function by address or reference and last one is no need to pass a structure directly declare structure variable as a global first one is passing structure to a function by value it means the whole structure is passed to another function with all members and their values so this structure can be assessed from called function let's see the example we have a student structure struct is a keyword student is the name of the structure and student structure having three data members id name and percentage of the student then function declaration is there void is a return type fun c is the name of the function the record is a argument which is of student structure type then inside the main function declare a structure variable how to declare structure variable struct keyword student is the name of the structure and record is the name of the variable we can assess the members of the structure with the help of dot operator how to assess members of the structure structure variable name record is the name of the structure variable dot operator then name of the member id is the name of the member equal to 1 value 1 is assigned to a member id then after that assign value to the second data member second data member is of string type then you use strcpy function strcpy function is a string library function which is inbuilt in string dot h header file SPS CPY function assign the value Raju to a member name. Then after that, assign the value to the third data member of the structure percentage. Record dot percentage is equal to eighty six point five. After that, we have to call the function. How to call the function? Name of the function. Then pass the argument. now in this case argument is of student structure type name of the argument is record when this function call control transfer to the definition of the function how to define a function return type name of the function then passing formal arguments struct is a keyword student is the name of the structure record is a function argument inside the body of function with the help of printer function display the id name and percentage of the student this is the first way to passing structure to a function in c second way is passing structure to a function by address it means only the address of the structure is passed to another function the whole structure is not passed to another function with all the members and their values so this structure can be assessed from called function by its address for example we have a structure student having three data members id name and percentage then declare a function 
void is a return type funs is the name of the function stuck is a keyword and student is the name of the structure passing pointer to a structure how to declare a pointer with the help of star operator then inside the main function declare structure variable the record is a structure variable which is of student structure type then with the help of dot operator assess the data members of the structure then after that call the function when we call the function now in this case whole structure is passed to another function by address it means only address of the structure is passed to another function instead of values the whole structure is known passed to another function with all members and their values in this case only the address of the structure is passed to another function so this structure can be accessed from called function by its address when we pass address of the structure then how to assess the members of the structure then use arrow operator to assess the members of the structure record is a structure variable then arrow operator with the help of arrow operator we can assess the members of the structure third way is to declare structure variables as global structure variable also can be declared as global variable as we declare other variables so when a structure variable is declared as global then it is visible to all the functions in the program in this case we do not need to pass the structure to any function separately for example we have a student structure having three data members id name and percentage then global declaration of structure is there stuck is a keyword student is the name of the structure and a record is a structure variable now in this case we have declared structure variable as a global then declare a function void is a return type structure underscore demo is the name of the function inside the main function assess the data members of the structure how to assess with the help of dot operator structure variable name dot operator then name of the member then after that call the function how to call the function by function name structure underscore demo is the name of the function then this function call control transfer to the definition of the function then inside the definition of the function with the printer function display the detail of the student id name and percentage next is passing indivisible structure members we can also pass indivisible members to a function just like ordinary variables let's see the code we have a structure student student structure having three data members name roll number and marks then after that declare a function how to declare a function return type name of the function then argument list name roll number and marks are the argument of the function then inside the main function we have declared structure variable stu is the name of the structure variable and team 1 or 78 values assigned to a variable stu then after that we have to call the function how to call the function name of the function then passing arguments stu dot name stu dot roll number and stu dot marks first argument hold the value team second argument hold the value one and third argument hold the value seventy eight then this function call control transfer to the function definition and the values of actual argument is copied into formal arguments then inside the body of function definition 
डिस्प्ले द वैल्यू ऑफ नेम रोल नंबर एंड मार्क्स विदाउट यूजिंग डॉट ऑपरेटर दिस इज अ वे टू पास स्ट्रक्चर मेंबर्स एज आर्गुमेंट टू द फंक्शन नेक्स्ट इज स्ट्रक्चर एंड पॉइंट सी स्ट्रक्चर कैन बी असेस्ड इन टू वेज इन सी प्रोग्राम फर्स्ट वे इज यूजिंग नॉर्मल स्ट्रक्चर वेरिएबल एंड सेकेंड वे इज यूजिंग पॉइंट वेरिएबल डॉट ऑपरेटर यूज टू असेस द डेटा यूजिंग नॉर्मल स्ट्रक्चर वेरिएबल इफ नॉर्मल स्ट्रक्चर वेरिएबल इज देयर देन वी कैन यूज डॉट ऑपरेटर विद द हेल्प ऑफ डॉट ऑपरेटर वी कैन असेस द डेटा एंड एरो ऑपरेटर यूज टू असेस द डेटा यूजिंग पॉइंटर वेरिएबल वी हैव ऑलरेडी लर्न how to assess structure data using normal variable in c so we are showing here how to assess structure data using pointer variables there are two operator arrow and star operator that are used to assess data members of a structure by using structure pointer let's see the code team is the name of the structure having three data members name members and captain And T1 is the structure variable. The value of name is India, and value of member is eleven, and value of captain is Dhoni. Then, with the help of star operator, we can declare a pointer to a structure. SPTR is the pointer to a structure that holds the address of T1 structure variable. T1 is the structure variable. and sptr is a pointer to a structure now with the help of pointer to a structure we can assess the members of a structure inside the main function with the help of printf function display the name members and captain let's see the another example Let's see the program to read and print student details using structure with pointer. First of all, create a structure. How to create a structure? Struct keyword, then name of the structure. Student is the name of the structure, and student structure having three data members: name, which is of character type; roll number, which is of integer type. and percentage which is of float type and structure body and with the closing curly braces and semicolon then inside the main function create a structure variable how to create a structure variable struct keyword then name of the structure then name of the structure variable s1 is a variable of student structure type then after that create a pointer to student structure how to create a pointer to student structure struct keyword then name of the structure and with star operator create a pointer to a student structure star ptr is a pointer to a student structure then after that assigning value of structure variable PTR is a pointer to structure that hold the address of structure variable. Ampersand is a address operator. After that, input the detail of the students like name, roll number, and percentage. Name is of string type. For string, we can use gets function. Name of the pointer to structure is PTR. Then we use arrow operator. if you want to assess members with pointer then use arrow operator the name of the member then after that with the help of scanf function input the roll number and percentage of the student then with printf function display the detail of the student as it is on to the screen percentage s is a format specifier for string 
percentage B is a format specifier for integer and percentage F is a format specifier for float. Use slash n for new line. The name of the pointer to a structure, arrow operator, then member name. With printer function, display the message input details. After that, with printer function, display the message display details. Now run this code. After the execution of this code, first of all, input the details of the student. Name of the student, then input the roll number of the student, then input the percentage of the student, then print a function, display detail as it is onto the screen. This is all about structure with pointer and structure with functions.